My name's Ricky Lee Braun. I'm the drummer in the Shooting Stars. I formed the band uh, originally a long time ago in 1991 with Marshall Lytle, the Comets bass player. And previous to this, we had an engagement with Marshall Lytle at Hemsby, which is why the band was formed originally. Suddenly Marshall passed away. And like, the band was only so good, we just decided to keep it going. For many years I've had an involvement with uh, Ricky Braun. We started our first band together, The Stargazers, nearly 30 years ago. When Ricky had the idea of starting The Shooting Stars, he asked me to um, be the record label, and also the, the management and booking agent. So uh, I leapt at the chance. I tried getting the original band back together, it didn't happen. So I decided to get a whole new band together. Uh, I put a guy called Big Steven, who's a fantastic singer. My name's Steve Arlene and I'm a singer-songwriter from London town. I've been living in America for nine years and I've moved back. been playing music quite a lot for the last 25 years in and around the UK. Come on, let's move down to Tennessee. They got a rock and roll situation. Ricky Braun phoned me up and asked me if I wanted to join his new outfit he was starting and I thought, what a great idea. Now you think not, we'll start it now. I'd recorded a song uh, called State Trooper, it's a Bruce Springsteen song, during the summer last year, and he'd seen it on the internet, and I'd known Helen for a lot of years, and uh, they came up with this idea that perhaps I could be the singer in the band. When I was writing at home, sometimes you seem a little aimless, but like when you know that you've got a band that you're directing stuff towards, it's really a fun way of approaching music. Players in the band are great, you know, really top notch, and um, it's just such a joy to play with everybody. I'm Helen Ingham, I'm the mandolin player in The Shooting Stars and I also write some of the songs and I print and design the artwork too. I've always printed stuff for the, and designed stuff for the bands I've been in. I was really happy to have so much involvement in all the processes of uh, producing this record. We're at the Apple Tree Hub in Mount Pleasant in London. It's a Sunday evening, early gig. It's going to be wonderful and looking forward to it. My name's Phil from Morgan. I play uh, steel guitar and dobro. Very proud to be down here tonight. It's a long-standing venue. My lead singer has been doing this show for, for many years, but it is our first gig, so there's going to be a few walks and a few halls. I've been running this particular show, Come Down and Meet the Folks, with Alan Tyler from The Rockin' Birds. And me and Alan have been running for 18 years now. Basically a weekly gig we used to put on in Camden Town because we were disgruntled musicians that were fed up of doing gigs and not getting any money. Everybody. We've had everybody from James Hunter play down here a lot, and Boz Bora play a lot. It's a real mixed bag of people, but people that are into roots yeah, music. The first gig they've ever done, I hope you're really going to enjoy it. From the Shooting Stars, everybody. <laughs>
I'm Darren Richards, I'm a double bass player for the Shooting Stars. I played with Ricky uh, Braun and Darren Lintz in the uh, Space Cadets last year and it was a great nucleus to get together. So here we are today at our launch gig. <laughs> Originally, we were going to almost take the line of a, an authentic Western swing band, but it's it's developed now. We've got a bit of rockabilly in there, a bit of blues. We've got some good crossover country stuff. Well, the devil's in my pocket. I got no one to blame. Been there all along, just the same. I don't know what to do. There's no way to run. I shoot like a sucker if I have me a gun. Gets it to my head and under my skin. All around me and deep within. Don't know what to do. I let it all end. The crazy little sucker sits around a bend. Go, devil, go. You got it all. You gotta go where the sun never shows oh. Western swing based but we're not going to be rehashing all the old kind of Bob Wills and the Spade Cooley stuff. You know, I mean, it has been done to death. I'm never going to do it any better than the original guys. We're just going to write our own stuff, or should I say primarily Steve, uh, and there's going to Ricky. Helen's writing, like a lot of the instrumentals. It's got a hot jazz western swing with a bit of 70s cowboy sort of stuff in there. There's a bit of everything. <laughs> Billy, it's more than rock and roll, it's more than blues, it's more than country and western, it's a whole, whole lot of genres there. They sum up all the music we love and that we've listened to for years. Say we're a Western swing band is a bit bit misleading, really. You know, there's just so much more to it. We're just working out what our best attributes are, I guess, at the moment. Sharing it with Helen and uh, whoever wants to sing. There's a sun behind the clouds when I said I stand proud. I'll see me on the other side. I feel I can't go on. Here come the shades of dawn. See now me on. moment I'm listening to ragtime and very early jazz you know and I'm also listening to uh, Creedence Clearwater Revival and Canned Heat and, and, it, and so it goes you know and all the rockabilly stuff in between it, it just goes on and on. Shooting Stars is a constantly evolving sound. You can't say it's one thing or another. It's a mixture of rocking blues, western swing, country jazz. A 
Oh, you look at me. I know because I can see. I'm not losing my mind. Oh, you look at me. I know because I can see. Yeah, you're laughing at me. Oh, I'm glad you think it's so fucking funny. Oh, I'm glad you think it's so fucking funny. Steve was in Nashville for quite some time, and as a singer songwriter, he brings a very much contemporary uh, sound to us. I'd be very interested to see what people think to it when they, they actually hear it for the first time. I don't mind doctors, I don't mind the pain Please don't leave me this way Oh, I'm glad you think it's all fucking funny Let's bring it out guys, let's sing! Oh, I'm glad you think it's so fucking funny. Oh, I'm glad you think it's so fucking funny. Oh, I'm glad you think it's so fucking funny. Got a, a different niche we've got with Steve Arlene fronting the band with his country feel. It's a great mix and real stripping back the uh, cause of what is rock and roll. She did everything right, she picked up pieces, left the law down, but she gives her lonely. But I took you off the ground and I made your mama cry. And, and I'm a strumming singer, songwriter guy, but I like up tempo, fast rock and, rock and roll, rockabilly, westy swing, all that stuff. <laughs> At this point in a new birth of a band, we're, we're all excited about it, you know, and that's great. We recorded this in the summertime. Helen, Helen printed the whole thing out at a letterpress printing workshop that she does. And she hand stitched the whole thing, so um, and I'm sure Ricky helped with stitching too. Green vinyl. Come and buy it up.
It was really nice for me to do a gig in my home turf tonight, and it, you know, it was a gig that was I could organise because I could book myself to play at it. So. Well, I walk down the street barefoot today. All my dreams have blown away. I'm in a place that I don't return. Ratchet to measure my body burns. The watch out, the watch out, the gold watch out, the watch out, the watch out, the watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. My body burns. Well, hell have the fury, so it is said. Still, my body burned on my head. Do not want water, can I see? A wolf of time is sitting around me. To the watch out, watch out. We're going to the watch out, watch out. We're going to the watch out, watch out. My body burns. It was, was outstanding. It was a packed, packed uh, room, and there was not enough room to, to swing a cat, let alone breathe or swing the bass around. It was absolutely ram solid. I was really pleased with the attendance. There was a lot of familiar faces we've not seen for a while, and uh, it was a great launch gig. We sold plenty of records and stuff. So if you miss this one, the very next time you have to pay to get it, because uh, this was a free one. Absolutely heaving, sweaty, lots of fun, people having a really good time. Oh, what a shooting stars, thank you.